Hi everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we are diving deep into a friend's space to declutter, decorate, and revitalize their family room, kitchen, and backyard. I recently had the honor to help my friend Julie revitalize and bring new life to these spaces, helping her choose the right colors and different things to just make everything flow just a little bit better. It was so much fun and she was so happy with the end result. Everything was clean and comfortable and very cozy and inviting and I'm gonna show you how I did all of it in today's video. After clearing everything away in this family room, I'm going to reintroduce some pieces of decor. I'm gonna start very slowly with some neutral colors. That way, Julie can add an accent pillow of any color that she chooses. So for right now, we're gonna stick to everything pretty neutral. Decluttering your home can do so much for your mental health. It can help reduce stress. It can enhance focus and productivity. It can also increase a sense of control. And by that, I mean sense of control that contributes to a feeling of mental peace and contentment within your own living environment. I encourage anybody that is watching this video today to just do one room. Declutter one room in your house and let me know how much better that makes you feel, how it brings you peace, how calming it is, whatever it may be but I would love to have some feedback on this and you can comment me over on my Instagram. I'm gonna leave my handle up here or you can just come back to this video and comment in the comment section. Over here on the mantle, I'm going to be adding this beautiful magnolia wreath and Julie found this at Joann's and I think it looks perfect over here. It adds that pop of green with those beautiful magnolia flowers that pick up the cream color over on the sofa and the throw that's draped over this beautiful antique rocking chair. One of my favorite ways to add a pop of color and brightness is adding a bouquet of fresh flowers. We picked these up at Trader Joe's and this soft pink color is going to look absolutely perfect in this kitchen. We had some wild colored bottles over here of dish soap, hand soap, and the packaging where the dish tabs went in. We just switched those out and used these beautiful glass bottles. I used these in my own home and then we picked a container to put the dish tabs in and then we have them sitting on this tray that we found at I believe it was Home Goods. The hand soap and dish soap bottles were found on Amazon and they do come with those beautiful labels and I will leave that linked down in my description box. We use that same concept over here by the stove by switching out the oil and vinegar bottles. And you can pick these up at any home store like Home Goods, Marshalls, uh, Ross, At Home, any of those stores. You can probably even find them on Amazon. By decluttering your kitchen, you can create a functional, efficient, and pleasant space that supports your culinary endeavors and promotes a healthier and more enjoyable cooking experience. 
Decluttering your kitchen is also very aesthetically pleasing. A clutter-free kitchen is visually appealing. It creates a sense of order and cleanliness, making the space more inviting and enjoyable to be in. It can also positively impact the overall aesthetic of your entire home. Now that we are finished with the inside, we're gonna head on outside and just make a few minor changes to bring this backyard back to life. Julie and her husband love to entertain and they spend a lot of time out here with their family as well. So we're just gonna add a few elements to help make everything a little more cozy. We added three cozy throw pillows to this bench and some really adorable lanterns and this little area is so much more inviting now. Julie absolutely loves the boho look and we were at at home and we found the perfect hammock and this one looks so much better. It flows better with the colors that we have chosen to use out here and it just makes everything flow just so much more, turning this backyard into the oasis that she wants and loves. For those cool nights when her family and friends want to sit around the fire, we thought it would be a great idea to add these adorable throw blankets and just drape them over each one of the chairs. And Julie has chosen some colors that flows with that boho look. We picked like the sea foam green and the peach and just those beachy type colors. And even though it was just a minor adjustment, it really cozied up the space. Thank you so much for joining me today in this video. I had so much fun hanging out with one of my very best friends and helping her turn her spaces into something more comfortable and just more relaxing. If you enjoyed today's video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button and you're going to wanna hit that notification bell as well so you don't miss out on any new videos. Thank you again for watching and I hope you guys all have an amazing day and I will see you in the next one. Bye.